salesperson comes in preaching that what they have to offer is the best. So instead of sounding different, we sound like every other salesperson calling on that individual. So we have to get out of the business of using the word best and position different in a meaningful way so that our buyers see we're the best without us ever saying the word. Sales differentiation provides you with the tools to personalize the buying experience. It's two-directional communication with an individual specific buyer. Everyone buys for a different reason. Why he buys is different than why she buys, than why he buys, and why she buys. But why do we even need sales differentiation? Why am I here? Win more deals at the prices you want. It's not just about winning business. It's to win more deals while protecting margins. Every interaction you have between yourself and a buyer provides you with opportunities to be different, to provide meaningful value that your competitors are not. The first part is sales differentiation in what you sell. And that's understanding what your differentiators are, when they're relevant, to whom they're relevant, having a strategy to position it in a meaningful way so that someone on the other side of the desk is just as excited about it as you are. But there's a lot we can do to be in that group that's first to offer value and insight in the relationship, and that's through how you sell sales differentiation. Raise your hand if you love cold calling. Yeah, I didn't think any hands were going up. But there's someone that hates it more than you. It's the people on the other end of the phone that know we're calling for one reason. I need a commission check. I ask salespeople, who's your toughest competitor? And three names always roll off their tongues. I'm sure you can all do the same. And I'm sure those are tough competitors. But there's one even tougher. And some of you may be thinking, oh, that old sales trainer one the status quo, the choice to do nothing. Also a formidable competitor. But there's one even tougher. Here's the deal, folks. If you can't get someone on the other side of the desk as excited as you are about your differentiators, you may as well not have them because there's only one conversation you're gonna have. And what is that? Bryce, what I'm saying is how you sell, not just what you sell, differentiates you.